Hey guys! So, um, yay! I'm, I'm back with another video. I have only done one since I moved, which is to show you how my K-pop collection looks now that I've moved. Um, and I'm now going to do my, my monthly K-pop update. So all the stuff that I got in September. Um, I didn't get very much, and I haven't really done unboxings, so... I do apologise, but I just, I just haven't, I don't know if, whether, if it's because I haven't got time or whether I just don't have the energy, I don't know. I'm getting old and lazy, so <laughs> that's probably the reason. Um, so I will show you um, all the CDs that I've gotten. There is really not that many, so yeah. So the first one is Girls' Day. I love Girls' Day. This is their first release, so when um, Jihei, Jiha, Jia. Uh, we're still in it. I'm not very good at pronouncing her name. Let's just have a look. It's got a lovely photo book in this one, by the way. So pretty. Um, yes, yeah, this is when they were five members. This is their first release. And, um, yeah, I just love Girls' Day. I think they are um, amazing. Oh, Jihei, yeah. So this was when um, Jihei was in it. Uh, my photo book is probably going to fall off, so I'm probably not going to do that again. But, yes, this is a really good little um, mini album. And... Um, I really love Girls' Day, like I've said, actually, probably a few times now. And I wanted to get all of their stuff, so I have that one. And I have their second one, Girls' Day, Every Day, Part 2. They are really clever with their, the way that they um, title their albums. So clever. I love this one as well, to be honest with you. And I really love the folk book. Although the folk books aren't very big, I just love the way that they do their folk books. So, yeah, I love Girls' Day. Have I mentioned that? Girls' day, because every day is girls' day. So yes, so I've got those two. <laughs> and I also got um, Expectation. Oh, you can't see them. I'm not doing a very good job of that, am I? Um, anyway, yeah, Girls' Day, Expectation, which I also have. I'll do it that way. Um, which I, I've got, I've got Female President, and I've got Something, and I've got Darling. So I've got all of them now, and I was just like, well... I kind of feel like I need to get this one. Didn't really need to get this one. It was a bit frivolous of me to get this one, but it's got a really nice photo book, and yeah, just yeah. So I have all my Girls' Day now. So um, yeah, do you like Girls' Day? I think I'm a bit of a daisy. I fall in love with too many bands. I think that's my problem. I'm a I'm a blackjack and a so on, and I'm a queen. And I'm, uh, I don't know what FX fans are called. Are they called a special effects? I don't think they've ever been given a fandom name, have they? Don't get into that, Kate. Don't get into that. Um, I'm also a pink panda. And now I'm a daisy. I've got too many girl groups that I love. But they're so brilliant and talented. So, you know. On top of being a VIP and an XOL. That's a really stupid name, by the way. And a prima donna. And a boy. Well, I fall in love too easily. You guys know that. So there we go. <laughs> Um, anyway, moving on. I'm putting that in there. The next one I got is uh, Super Junior's Mamacita. Um, I love Super Junior. I really do love Super Junior. And I was so impressed with this. I really, I'm not really a big fan of Super Junior as albums, but I really love this album. Um, it's really cool. And I was so impressed. I love the video. I love the fact that they released the normal video and then like the drama version and my song mini my song mini is just like oh i put it on my favorite picture mm. um my song mini does not have a good video he gets knocked out it's not really much of him he's just looking gorgeous and i don't really understand kangen and the watermelon thing but you know bounty hunter's looking pretty good sheriff is looking pretty good and yeah i was just really impressed with the super junior comeback um photo card um, I believe this is Shindong, uh, who's looking really good in this comeback, like, hello. So, uh, this is Shindong as a bean, or a little one. So, yeah, I was hoping for Sungmin, but I don't mind. I quite like the fact that I got Shindong, because obviously, like, he's off to do his military service soon. So, kind of quite like that I've, I've got his card, although it doesn't look like him. Well, it does. That's probably the scary thing, it probably does look like him. I'm going to put that there. Yeah. Um... Then we have um, Tiara uh, and an end, which is a bit of a um, mouthful. I really love his comeback as well. I'm so impressed with the album. Um, it's really good. Uh, one thing I'm not impressed with, and considering how much of a big Tiara fan I am, I don't really like the photo book. I don't really think it kind of 
matches the lead song and it's a bit I don't know normally with tiara albums they're really long and I really like that about them it feels a bit it's screaming to be repackaged to be honest with you I don't know whether or not that's something they're going to do but um, I really like sugar free it's really catchy and it always you know I, I have it on in my kitchen and it helps me when I've got to do the dishes I'm like right let's put some tiara on and let's get motivated and then I do get motivated so I'm just moving things around because I'm fussy and then the last one to show you is Hola! 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 Um, okay, so let's have a little bit of a chat about Tato CO, TTS, and Girls' Generation. Did, was I, did I like this comeback? Um, it's okay. It's, no, it's not as catchy as Twinkle. I really love, oh, I really love Tiffany in that dress. I think that's such a beautiful picture. Um, I wasn't overly impressed with this album. It's okay. It's a typical kind of girls' generation album. There's a few good songs on there, but as a whole, it's not really um, like my. It's not like going to be change change my life or anything like that. But Whisper's probably my favourite song on there, to be honest with you. But yeah, I really, you know, it's okay. I'll support the girls. Um, Obviously, this has been a bit of a difficult week for so ons, including myself, because I do consider myself to be a, a so on, I suppose, because I love them, uh, with the whole Jessica leaving. Um, it's been pretty heartbreaking. I couldn't believe it when I woke up to the news. So I'm not quite sure what's going to happen in the future. Um, well, we shall see. But for whatever reason, Jessica is going on her own way, whether that's her decision or whether she's been kicked out. Who knows? I don't know who's side of the story to believe and I'll never know all I know is that I am a so on because of nine beautiful angels and I will continue to support all nine beautiful angels even if it's eight on one side and one on the other uh, I really just wish that SM would learn their bloody lesson because they really are just so frustrating and a part of me feels like I just want to boycott SM completely but I can't because I love Girls' Generation and XO so much and Super Junior and well it's just very frustrating so it's been really difficult I just hope that it all gets sorted out I would really hate for all nine girls to just fall out and it be the end they've just signed a three-year contract so oh I don't know fingers crossed guys that everything gets sorted out but who knows um yeah I'm feeling pretty sad but anyway there we go um I got Soyeon's card on it as well and that's pretty cool because I got Soyeon in um, my twinkle as well Mm, it came out wrong. I mean, in the Twinkle release, yeah. Um, so, yeah, I've gotten Sony on twice, so I'm quite happy with that. So, uh, yes, there we go, guys. That's my monthly K pop collection. Please leave a comment uh, or like this video or subscribe if you want to. Obviously, if you don't want to, then I can't make you. But, um, yeah, till next time, guys. Hopefully, it won't be so long. Ciao.